Hey guys, so I'm going to be doing my Valentine's Day makeup tutorial and I wanted to do a talk through video because I haven't talked to you guys in a while and I thought it would be fun. So prior to turning on the camera, I've already applied my foundation and I'll have that information down below and I already filled in my eyebrows and I'll have that information down in the description box as well. So for my Valentine's look, I wanted to do something that it's quite affordable and pretty accessible because I'm putting this video up last minute so if you decide that you want to do this look and um, you're pressed for time, the e.l.f. Um, 144 palette I believe is now kind of generally just sold in Targets. I see them all the time and if not the big one, the size smaller and it's really inexpensive it's like I think it's originally $15 but most of the time they have them on sale anyways or if you already have it uh, I thought this would be really helpful and I'm going to start off with the elf uh, mineral eyeshadow primer I find that this primer works really well with elf products I don't really notice it doing really well with other brands uh, not that it's really bad but I especially like using this primer when I use my e.l.f. products. So I'm just going to put this all over my lid and also on my lower lash line. I'm going to take a cream eyeshadow. This is from Revlon in, what is this called? Pink Petals. And I've had this forever. And I'm going to apply this just to the lid. Next I'm going to go into the e.l.f. 144 palette and use this really pretty uh, maroon type of color down here in the palette using the e.l.f. smudge brush. I'm going to tap off the excess because these shadows are kind of powdery and apply it into my crease. And I'm also creating sort of like a wing shape when I do this. Once I have that applied, I'm just going to take a clean brush, uh, any brush that's kind of fluffy will work, and just blend out this color upwards into my crease. So it's not harsh. Then I'm going to add some definition by using this color down here, right under the maroon color I just put into my crease, and a the e.l.f. Studio Contour br Brush, and I'm going to just place that into this little socket right here. And I'm not going to move my brush, I'm just going to wiggle it. And that's how I get it exactly where I want without it moving just yet. Because right now all we're trying to do is apply the color. Then we're going to blend that into our crease color. Then I'm going to apply this matte kind of tannish color up here all over my lid. Once you have that applied, you're just going to go ahead and blend out this uh, line that you've created so that's a little bit more of a smooth transition. I'm also going to use the same color on my brow bone. Excuse my eyebrows, I need to get them 
done. So, don't be talking about me in the comment section. <laughs> and then just blend again. Now I'm going to take the color that I used in my outer corner and use the same smudge brush and take this color under my lower lash line. And that's pretty much it for the shadows. Then I'm going to go ahead and apply my <clears throat> excuse my voice. And then I'm gonna go ahead and apply my e.l.f. essentials liquid liner um, from the dollar line and then the e.l.f. mineral infused mascara. Both of these products I believe you can pick up at Target and Walgreens if you are trying to get these products last minute. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply those and then I'll be right back. Now that I am all highlighted and contoured and all of that good stuff. I'm going to go ahead and add my lip color. Today I am going to be using um, the color Bare It All from Wet n Wild and their matte lipsticks. I want a nude lip with this. I'm just going to go ahead and apply it. And then to add a little bit of a pinky kind of color to it, I'm going to apply a little bit of the e.l.f. Glossy Gloss in Pink Candy on top of it mostly focusing this in the center and then just kind of blending it out. Then the final step to all of this is to go ahead and set your makeup and your face. So I'm going to be setting my makeup with, uh, 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 I can't talk, I'm going to be setting my face with the CoverGirl Ready Set Gorgeous Powder in medium deep using this brush that my sister gave me and I love it. I've used it pretty much every single day since she gave it to me almost two years ago. It's an amazing brush. should ask her where she got this because I need another one. Okay. And we are all done. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you found it helpful. I tried to use, as you can see, very affordable products, mostly e.l.f. products. Uh, sorry if that annoyed you. I know a lot of people either like love e.l.f. stuff or hate e.l.f. stuff. But if you're interested in seeing more e.l.f. tutorials in the future, leave me a comment down below and thumbs up this video. I hope you guys have an amazing Valentine's Day. And thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!